Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is gonna to be a bit of an unusual video. I was actually on my way to grab a quick tea from the vending machine, which is right next to my house. And I was thinking about, actually, how many vending machines there are around my area? And the more I thought about it, the more I wanted to find out. And so I decided to actually just make a video about it. So something that I can learn today and something I can show you guys today. Uh, so yeah, let's get to it. Let's show you how many vending machines are in this area. Because this is Tokyo, the land of vending machines. Let's go. All right, so I decided to set the goal today to just be a simple goal, that's something that we can stick to. So I live pretty close to one of the major areas of Tokyo here. It's about a 10 minute walk from one of the major stations. And so basically I'm just gonna walk from my house to the station and just gonna try to catch as many vending machines as I can on the way and just show you, uh, and just show you them. So uh, yeah, but first get on the mask. Mask is good, okay. Got my shoes. All right, and let's go. Okay, so I'm right next to one of the closest finishings next to my house. I don't want to give you the exact one next to my house just because, you know, stalkers maybe. Uh, but in any case, this is one of the first ones. And uh, it's quite common. It's a basic one. You have your uh, Pepsis, water, teas, uh, your energy drinks. They has, this one actually has a Mountain Dew, which is pretty rare. Uh, apple juice and uh, some coffees. Now, something you'll see here, uh, maybe it's close enough. Uh, the blue means that it is cool. Uh, it says sumatai. Sumatai means cooled or like cold, uh, something that's cold. And here you have uh, atakai, which is something that's warm. So these are going to be your warm drinks and your cool drinks. So yeah. All right. On to the next one. By the way, guys, I'm, uh, I'm doing this video at night, so I don't look too much of a creep because I'm doing this by myself. And uh, so I'm in a popular area. Uh, some people always kind of stare at me when I'm doing this, so I don't want to stand out too much as I already do. And uh, oh, there's one right over there, just as we're walking. Look closely next to that deer statue. Yep, again, a very basic one. Okay, so so far, in the matter of just like less than 100 meters, two vending machines. Okay, on to the next one. Now, as you kind of see here, I live in a more like residential area, which is just right outside of the central area. Again, it's not even a 10 minute walk to get in there, so. It's quite interesting, like, maybe your image of Tokyo is full of uh, high build- Oh, oh, wait, sorry, gotta shut up because, uh, boom, another one. That's number three, number three. And then you take two steps over here and you're like, what, what, and just have a nice day, and then boom, you got a Pikachu one. There's actually no Pikachu or Pokemon items. It's just designed with Pikachu. So, what's that? Three, four, this is number four. About like 150 meters out and uh, already four vending machines. Okay, let's go to the next one. All right, do I, no, and nearby, okay, okay, okay. I could talk for a moment. Okay, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, about, I think we are talking about the residential area, living out here in the residential area. Uh, there are tons and tons of uh, mansions, so these are called mansions. Uh, Japanese they call them, uh, basically a mansion is a townhouse, not an actual mansion. And that's just their word for it. And so you'll see a bunch of these like townhouse mansions, buildings all around here, right outside the central area. So, it's quite common. Oh wow, not a vending machine inside, oh! I spoke too soon because I see. Let's zoom in on that one. Number five and number six. So five and six right there. About a quarter of a kilometer out and got six fitting machines. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. 
Look farther down. There's actually two more right down there. There's two right there. Seven, eight. Eight. Okay. <laughs> that woman looked at me when I said eight really loudly. All right, sorry, I apologize. That's eight. And, <laughs> guess what? Boom! Nine, right here. So, not even a half a kilometer from my apartment to the station, and we already got nine vending machines. Wow. <laughs> this is quite astonishing for me as well. All right. And, oh yeah. Guess what? Boom. I think that's number 10. 10. 11. 10 and 11 right here. Man, seriously, we're not even halfway there yet and we're at 11 Vingdom machines. My God. Okay, keep it going. As I'm getting closer to the station, uh, there's gonna be a lot more people walking. So, I'm gonna try not to freak them out. That's again why I'm doing this at night. So it's not as many and it's not as crowded. Okay, that was 11. Oh, there we go. I see number 12 across the street. There, there you go. Number 12. Okay. So 12. Oh, there we go. Walking, walking, walking. Okay, so now we are at number 13 and 14. 14, and we are we are at the halfway mark, pretty much. So, so far along the main road, mainish road, uh, 14 vending machines and about a kilometer. So, uh, and I don't even think that's like, I think that's like, that's pretty normal, I think. I, mean, I think that's pretty normal, actually. That is, uh, you'll pretty, pretty much find that everywhere around here, so. Okay, so just kind of walked through about 100, 200 meters of like no vending machines and I was kind of curious as to why there's not any, but then I realized, oh, that's because supermarkets right here, drugstore, supermarket, 7-Eleven. Okay, so we're coming up to the 15th and 16th one, which is right over there. Uh, number 15 and number 16. And as you see, we are getting really close to the city. Uh, this is a big karaoke building right there. Uh, just so you guys know, that whole building is dedicated solely to karaoke. So uh, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven floors of here at karaoke, in karaoke rooms. Okay, and as we walk two steps further, we have a Coca-Cola one right here. This is number 17. This is a smaller one, but still counts. And I see 18, 19, and 20 right over there 18 19 and 20 right there so far 20 vending machines and a little over halfway there to the station let's keep going Okay, 
There we are, number 21 and 22, right there. And now I see a whole slew of them. Right over there. 23, 24, 25, 26. 26. Okay. As you see, we are literally like, we're smack dab. One of the major parts of Tokyo here. And we're at 26 so far. So we made it here to the station and uh, can't actually find one near the station, which is quite strange. I thought there was actually gonna be a few out here. I think just maybe on this side. On the other side, there are definitely some, and especially inside the station, you'll find a lot. But uh, 26, 26 uh, vending machines in a matter of a 10 minute walk from my apartment to this station, which is quite a lot. I did not expect that. I was actually thinking more of like 15, the 20, the 26. And honestly, I think that's pretty average actually out here. Uh, anywhere you go, you're gonna find that amount of vending machines everywhere. So, uh, but yeah. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys enjoy it, uh, please let me know. Uh, give me a like on this video. Uh, subscribe if you want to. All that shindig. All that shabazz. But anyways guys, I hope you have a fantastic day or night, wherever you are, and as always, peace.